Good Monday evening, everybody. Forecaster Zach Briscoe here with the Hazardous Weather Prediction Center. We see our next storm system already forming in the Great Lakes here, and that's going to be bringing snowfall from the Great Lakes down into the Mid-Atlantic and then the Northeast as we head tonight into tomorrow. As we look at our snowfall forecast, places like Pittsburgh, 3 to 6 inches of snow for you. Buffalo, 3 to 6. Then you push up to Boston and Portland, Maine. You're going to be seeing 3 to 6 inches of snow as you head into tomorrow. 1 to 3 inches of snow in parts of West Virginia over to Baltimore, D.C. area. You'll be seeing 1 to 3 inches of snow. And then after this storm system, we're going to see a warm-up and then the potential for a severe weather outbreak as we head later in the week. On Thursday, a trough will be digging down into the Midwest and that'll be spawning a strong low pressure system over the Midwest, bringing out warm moist air out of the Gulf of Mexico, and we'll see some storms starting to form in the Midwest. Potentially damaging winds and isolated tornadoes will be possible. As you can see that threat here, on Thursday, we'll see that cold front stretched across the Midwest, bringing those severe weather from eastern Texas up into Ohio there. And then on Friday, that cold front pushes eastward, and you'll see severe weather potentially from Pennsylvania, New Jersey, down into Georgia. This is just showing the potential for the worst of the severe weather right now. Uh, some isolated severe could stretch north or south of those regions. And uh, we'll have live coverage for you once that severe weather gets here on Thursday. If it looks like it's going to be a pretty bad event, we'll have live coverage showing you all the current warnings in effect, showing you the worst storms and where there's any rotation. So stay tuned to the Hazardous Weather Prediction Center for more updates.